All right, here's the video. I'm gonna use it on my MPD-218. So this pad is hooked up to um, record box, my laptop to record box, similar to how you would do your um, uh, MPK, whether you connect your MPK directly to a mixer or you connect your MPK directly to your laptop. Right now I have my MPD-218 hooked to the back of my mixer. And when I pull up record box, I'll show you. I click on MIDI. All right? MIDI window comes up. I'll select sampler and I select my connected device and then I'm going to click add. And then I'm going to select sampler. I'll do one through and three. One. I'll add number two. And I'll add number three. And I'll show you what happens. All right. Just so you can see. Record box. Here's the banks. I got sine wave at one. Siren at two. Horn at number three. Okay, so here's the connected device. When I click on learn, I'll press pad one. Okay, I'll press pad two. And as you can see, it registers 89.25. Okay, you see, I'm hitting it again, it doesn't work. I'm hitting it again, it doesn't work. See, you heard me originally hit it, it worked, but it doesn't work. I hit number three, it registers, but now it doesn't work. Or how you have it, how you hit it, it doesn't work, right? It's how you tap it. So I want to show you 8926. That's when I just tap it. Now I'm going to hold, I'm going to hold the pad down and watch it change. See, 9926. If I let go, it goes to 8926. 9926 and I'm holding it, see? I'm holding it. I'm holding it. I let go, 89.26. I let go, 89.26. So the 89.26 that's registered when I just tap it is the wrong code. The 99.26 is the correct code. So what I have to do is I'll unlearn it and it keeps that code. Now, every time I press the button for sampler play three, It'll work. See, I can just tap it. If it's at, I'll do a learn again, and I'll show you. If I leave it at, if I leave it at 89.26, and then I click unlearn, 89.26, watch. Doesn't work. See? This is the reason why it doesn't. You gotta hold it down. So when you learn it, you gotta press and hold so it gets to the second code. Learn, second code, unlearn. Now, it'll work, right? I'll try sampler two, okay? I'll click learn. Okay, you see, look, look, if I'm just tapping it, you see it change a little bit. If I hold it, it'll change to the right code. And if I click on learn, see, it works. And it lights up, see? 
and it'll play until it's done. Once it's done, the light will go out. Same thing at, at sample number one. I'm gonna click learn and I'm going to press and hold number one. Let's see. Okay, learn that one. So let me go here to number one. Click learn. All right. I'm going to press and hold it. 9924. I'm going to unclick learn. See, it works now. Number two works. Number three works. I'm going to show you another video. What I'll do is I'll unplug my MPD 218 and I'll show you similar to your keyboard. Okay, but I got the full version. So I'm gonna let this go. It's disconnected. I'm gonna put that aside and I'm gonna pull out. All right, so just like your uh, MPK Mini, I have also an MPK 249. And I have hooked this up to my laptop or you can hook it directly to a mixer. And what I'll see is in record box, as you can see, it comes up and I'll add the same thing as I did for my MP, um, MPD 218. So I'm gonna add the three banks, add sampler three. Okay, and it's on learn. As you can see it's pressed on learn. And as you can see, it doesn't work, right? Same thing with my MPD. And it's probably the same thing that's going on with yours because I'm just tapping it. And you can see, look, it's gently changing when I just tap it. But if I hold it, it changed to another code. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to scroll down Scroll down, click unlearn. Now, as you can see, it works now. See, it works. You gotta hold the key down to register the right code. So I'm gonna click learn again for sample bank two, which is the siren. Okay, I'm gonna tap the pad, as you can see, I tap the pad, it's gently changing between 913 and 813, but I want to hold it. I want to register 913. I'll go down to learn. And as you can see, it works. See? Now it works. And I'll do the same thing with three. I'll go to Sample bank three. I'll tap it, see? It registers the wrong code. See, I'm just tapping it. And you're thinking that it's registering the right code, but it's not. You gotta press and hold it. Press and hold it. It registers the right code. And you click unlearn. Now it works, see? So it's based on pressure. So your MPK mini, you need to press and hold the pads like this to register the right code. I hope that was helpful.